Yo guys, what up? Welcome back to Julius Ed and for now we're gonna actually discuss on the new uniforms and what you actually should get, you know, because uh, we have the uniform sale right now and uh, you know, you wanna be uh, certain that you're buying the best, uh, the best uniform for your crystals so let's actually check them all out man I should have actually <laughs> just uh, picked them all uh, or picked all of the new uniforms that I bought and favorited them uh, but yeah now let's check all of the uniforms right here I'm guessing this would be even easier let's start with the first uniform that we see right here and that is Quicksilver and basically this guy is amazing but uh, even with this uniform he's pretty amazing okay so uh, I would say that if you are short on crystals and or even if you have a lot of crystals but you want to save for uh, uh, purchases in Black Friday uh, sales I would suggest that if you have this uniform you could actually postpone buying the new one maybe uh, just because you know uh, even if you get him to tier 3 because just uh, one month later you'll be able to get it at 50% off and the difference is uh, pretty much noticeable at tier 3 to be honest because probably at tier 3 uh, even small hits uh, get noticed even more with the damage so that's my opinion man you gotta, gotta understand that uh, on the classic look he doesn't do he won't be able to do as much as on the uniformed looks but if you have the classic uh, the classic look basically you can buy the new one uh, but if you already have the purple one you can actually wait one month more and uh, then get the new one so you won't be uh, missing out on a lot let's go next with Luna definitely buy this uniform if you have this character at tier 2 or even better at tier 3 you have to get this uniform okay even if you have the Andromeda suit you definitely need the new one because of her fourth skill on her fourth skill now she has a 5% decrease of cold resistance which is stackable up to 30% and ignores immunity for 7 freaking seconds why is that great? well basically check out uh, Jin Grey's uh, skills you will see that on some of her skills she decreases mind resistance uh, well sure for her it uh, goes up to 100% uh, it is stackable to 100% but still, the damage should be insane, even uh, even at the uh, 30%. So basically, what this means is that uh, it's pretty much an all defense down. But in my opinion, against Ebony, the uh, type resistance decreases are even better than all defense down. I'm not saying that that will is worse, but just saying that uh, uh, type. Uh, resistance decreases are a lot more fun and they only work for the characters that have them of course because for example if you give uh, the boss cold resistance decrease and then go with uh, Jean she won't be able to do shit because she has mind damage or fire damage stuff like that so yeah definitely buy this uniform it's really gonna increase her damage it also gives her like a uh, uh, more cold damage as well in here like 15% more and uh, couple that with uh, White Fox's uniform which uh, gives her passive or gives her a higher uh, passive from the uniform as soon as I can find her right here I'll show you uh, White Fox there you go on her uniform you get like 10% uh, increase of all attacks for allies with leadership so that would apply to Luna so you're getting like 25% decrease to Luna's damage but apart from that she also has the cold damage resistance decrease which will, which will definitely be freaking amazing and the damage is gonna be insane uh, after that let's uh, check out the rogue 
Rogue is definitely one of the best uniforms to buy right now. Uh, well, not the best uniforms to buy right now, but I mean uh, one of the uniforms that will like in increment the power level of uh, the characters more than uh, all the other uniforms that we got in this update. And basically, this girl was really, really freaking bad. Uh, but now she is definitely gonna be really good as you saw in world boss ultimate as well her damage just is insane it, she's really really good she really got fixed up and uh, of course she has a heal as well so, so she is one of the safe characters to use in uh, world boss ultimate uh, next we have crescent I guess if you don't really care about crescent you could skip this one it's not game changing it's not something that amazing it just makes her a little bit easier uh, or it kind of tricks you into thinking that you have a, a uniform that you can proc on but as I tested it's very very hard to proc with this girl like even doing the fifth skill and this is an extreme obelisk so the proc should be uh, really consistent by the way I'm sorry that I'm yawning a lot of times but it is really early for me uh, but yeah, I haven't slept a lot, I'm sorry. Uh, but yeah, she really is hard to proc with. If you look at the uh, live stream that I did for reacting to the new update, uh, I actually tested her there and you can, you will see that uh, yeah, it is kind of uh, hard to proc with her. But still, uh, if you like her as a character though, you still should get it, why not? She's pretty cool. Let's see the skills for this guy, I think I... Uh, max them out. Oh, actually, I need to max this one out just for the decrease of all speeds. I don't really use the second skill a lot, but maybe I will start to use it uh, now that he has uh, uh, more hits in there. Uh, to be honest, I basically will max out all of his skills as soon as I tier 3 him, uh, but that's gonna take a little while because, uh, as you can see, I need like uh, 500 and uh, 33 more CCF but still it's gonna take a while but I'm gonna do it now as I said with Crescent you don't really need to get it uh, she's pretty okay uh, she is a, a bit better with damage but it's not something crazy or insane uh, next let's talk about Scar Scarlet Witch I don't have her uniform yet and I don't know if I'll get it well to be honest I will get it because I will get all the uniforms in this game uh, well, all of the good uniforms in this game. Uh, basically, from what I tested, um, the power level is pretty much the same uh, with the Infinity War uniform and the Uncanny Avengers uniform. Uh, if you don't have any of her uniforms, uh, you could go with the look that. Oh my god, I'm so sleepy. Never mind. Uh, you could go with the look that you uh, like the most. Uh, so basically these these will do both uh, but it was a bit more consistent proccing with this uniform so if you uh, want to be able to proc way easier you could do uh, you could get this one and she looks pretty badass and sexy so it should be good uh, but that's pretty much it about Scarlet, Scarlet Witch's uniform let's go to the next contender uh, Sabertooth to be honest, you can skip this uniform, uh, it will definitely give him damage, but it's not gonna change anything in the game a lot, or the meta, it's not gonna break something. Uh, but still, if you really like this character and you already have him at tier 2, uh, you could go ahead and get it, it's a pretty cool uniform, uh, one of uh, like his skill. Um, can be uh, casted differently basically by the m amount of time that you hold the skill he will do uh, different attacks so that is pretty fun but yeah that's pretty much about it for him now let's see who else did we get with a uniform hmm now I forgot <laughs> uh, okay white fox of course so for white fox as I said um, it will definitely gonna make her uh, more usable to be honest like as I tested her out in World Bus Ultimate she is usable I'm not saying she's as good as uh, uh, some of the metas that we have or tier 3 characters but she can hold her, her own and now she got like 
two more iframes which makes her uh, even better to use and uh, by the way just getting her uniform you are definitely gonna increase the support for uh, Luna Snow so if you want to deal a lot of damage with uh, Luna Snow you definitely have to get this uniform to make your job easier uh, but if you don't really care about that then you're gonna you're gonna be good I, I guess uh, with vision look if you have this universal uniform that goes for gold by the way you should be pretty good uh, of course this one doesn't really change any, feel, any of his skills so you may still want to get the new uniform uh, the new uniform actually gives him uh, a skill change the fifth and the fifth increases all attack all speed and critical rate which is pretty good and I think the invincibility is there anyway even if you don't have it yep so uh, basically it will just give you one skill change and that's about it uh, it will also uh, in increase his all attacks by 20% uh, as well so yeah you could get a bit more damage out of him uh, it's a just a 750 uniform so basically uh, it's uh, one on the cheaper side of uniforms but still you could get this one which is for gold and uh, pretty much be okay with his damage uh, even on world event yesterday we had a, a, a vision with this uniform and to be honest he was pretty badass okay he was pretty badass <laughs> I had a lot of fun with him uh, I think there was War Machine in there as well, but I just played with uh, Vision and I was pretty uh, amused and entertained, so I really didn't care about uh, War Machine. So basically, uh, it is apparent that a lot of people are not getting the new uniform since in World Event top uh, player didn't. So yeah, to be honest, you can skip Vision as well. He's pretty amazing even with, even without the uniform uh, anyway. So yeah, you should be golden. Now, uh, I don't know if I forgot a uniform, but let me see right here. Nope, they don't show all the new uniforms. Oh, actually, they do, kinda. Okay, so I think I talked about all of them, but yeah, to be honest, this is my opinion. Of course, it will definitely depend on your builds and stuff like that, so you shouldn't take everything uh, as a baseline and uh, just do it because I say it, it definitely depends on which characters you have at tier 3, which ones you want to get to tier 3, uh, what uniforms you already have of the characters, what uniforms you don't really have of the characters. By the way, the second keyword is gonna be phone. Uh, and yeah, it definitely depends on uh, your situation, it depends on how many crystals you've got. You really have to prioritize uh, uniforms that make characters from 0 to pretty freaking nice, like uh, Rogue. Uh, you really have to care about uh, increasing your scores maybe or increasing the, um, the level or stage of a world boss ultimate that you can clear with that Luna can Luna's uniform can help and white foxes as well coupled together it's gonna be really good um, you are gonna prioritize if you're gonna tier 3 quicksilver soon then sure you will have to get his new uniform just for more hits and basically more damage you will have to think about if you just want to get uniforms that make bad characters a bit better you could get uh, the one for crescent it's not amazing but it will just make her a little bit better uh, the one for sabertooth maybe as well so yeah it, def it definitely depends on your situation but yeah i hope you like this video man uh i'll see you guys on the next one okay bye bye by the way actually <laughs> let's not stop yet uh, apart from the keywords that you have to uh, comment down below, tell me which uniforms you got, which uniforms you like the most, and uh, what you think about uh, my opinion on the uniforms that you have to buy from this update and the ones that you have to skip, or not have to skip, but you could skip. And uh, by the way, also be subscribed. Don't uh, don't forget that. Uh, apparently, YouTube is uh, actually starting to uh, delete unused accounts from uh, like your subscribers so basically they notified me already they 
every time I would uh, upload a video there they, it was a, like there was a bar on top that said uh, on the next few days you're gonna see a, de a decrease in uh, subscribers basically we're removing inactive accounts or uh, people that are yeah basically in inactive accounts that's the right word for it but yeah I'll, I'll, uh, let's not be uh, panicked so that's why I meant it you don't really need to care about it too much it's basically this account is very old this YouTube account and I used to have some subscribers before so that's why you're gonna see a severe drop in uh, subscribers but anyway uh, we we can do it together anyway we can, you could help and we could increase again in numbers but anyway guys make sure to be subscribed tell me what you thought in the comments and uh, of course don't forget to use the two keywords to join the giveaway and I'll see you guys tomorrow okay bye bye